beachfront view. Frankie and I are, are talking about uh, some of our favorite front flippers. Front flipper knives. Got to talk about the booze smoke. Yes, the mini smoke that we probably should send back. Yeah, we don't even own this. I don't want to send it back though. It's a prototype. Maybe it got lost in the mail. That happens sometimes. It does. Okay, front flippers. Real quick, on the front flipper uh, topic, I will say. Yes. So somebody had described it, and I think this got a few thumbs up along the way, but somebody had described the front flipper as a solution to a problem that never existed. <laughs> I sort of understand where they're saying with that. Oh, you got the feist. Yeah, I have the feist one. too. A little small for my hand, but gentleman carry front flipper. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good one. What do you have over there? Actually, on the budget end. So this is a good one. This is the Real Steel Metamorph. Metamorph. This is the Indiana Knives particular version. Mm -hmm. um, the G10 version there. But yeah, uh, front flippers. There's a lot of small ones out there. There are. And actually, um, yeah, well, it, it really all comes down to that front flipper tab. That, yes. that flipper tab mm -hmm. on how well they function. Yeah. Um, but... So going to Blade Show 2019, we saw a front flipper that is absolutely worth uh, picking up in our collection. Checking out. Video yes. worthy. All, all of the above, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, we're talking Best Tech. Yes. Good stuff already from Best Tech. All right. That is really pretty Frankie, too. this is the drum roll. Shinkansen. Shinkansen. <laughs> it's a really long word. It's shinkansen. Sin. Yeah, maybe it's not that bad. Maybe I'm making it more complicated. But what's cool about it? Okay. It's it's bullet train in Japanese. Okay, so translated, yes, it is a Japanese mm -hmm. word. It is bullet, bullet train. train. I've been on a bullet train. Have you? I actually have not. I have. Okay. They're really really fast. All right, cool. You They're can sneak. have your you can have your bulletproof coffee on the, oh, on the train. Oh, that's true. Well, yeah. that was way before. <laughs> the last time I was on a bullet train was way before the keto fad happened. The keto fad. Okay, uh -huh. we're getting a little off topic now. Yes. But uh, back back to the back um, to the knife. Back to the knife, though the Shinkansen. <laughs> so this is a front flipper. When I first saw it, I'm like, yeah, it looks cool, it looks good. We know that Best yeah. Tech does uh, well. Their work rivals we knives. Yeah, it does. Um, is what Frankie and I often say, but uh, yeah, good stuff on this one. Okay. Um, ended up picking it up because I think we were shown this knife yes. actually um, because of the front flipper here. Mm -hmm. And we'll show you that. Okay. You could say that's a somewhat substantial tab. Yeah, he, he's a bit tabby. But, but it works really well. Doesn't it just make for a superior action? Well, and this is a much bigger front flipper than say look how little the face well, is just the size of the knife of yeah. course yeah so actually what is the blade length on that one there it is 3.625 3.625 okay so a little maybe uh bigger than average if you're saying three and a half is mm, average yeah okay <laughs> hey all right well, that's all right bigger than average actually let's get the price out of the way there okay so this is a premium best tech so it's 199. 199, and there are four varieties uh -huh. as of now. Four different colors. This is the bronze. Okay. Then it also comes in like an all titanium with the carbon fiber, blue and green. Blue and green, and actually all of them with this carbon fiber inlay. Yeah. Okay. There but the thing that's different too is about the the blue and the green ones. The little accent that's blue here is gold in the okay. other ones. Okay. Yeah. So we're talking the pivot collar the backspacer and the clip yes. are either blue or gold. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, gold, right? Yeah, gold. Yeah. Yeah, good stuff. Speaking of the pivot there, I actually really like that. Yes, yeah, it doesn't design. have the B that they usually have. Yeah. So it's, it's not, different. yeah, it's, it's sort of like a, um, it's sort of like a, not proprietary pivot, but kind of along those lines. You mm -hmm. just, but you just flip it over and you've got the torques there. Yeah. Yeah. Man, it is smooth though. Okay, talk about an addictive action on this one as Frankie messes it up. I know, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. I'm... Oh, okay. There we go. I can always edit. Okay, you know, yeah, you should have edited that. Yeah, Did you yeah. edit it? I'm trying to get you my better. hand in here. Okay. Okay. All right. The retraction on this thing is absolutely perfect. Mm -hmm. It's so addictive and it's got a little click um, confirmation there. All right, check this out. Yeah. Listen. When it locks in, it's perfect. Oh, it's so nice. Mm -hmm. It's so nice. Yes. 
And so what are you getting for the one ninety nine? You're getting well, S thirty five VN. It is S thirty five VN. We mentioned it's uh, you know three point six five um, blade length on there. Yeah. Okay. I believe they're all are they yeah bead blast finish on the mm -hmm. blade. Let's actually show a close up of that. Yeah, just a, a pretty basic drop point, really. Right. It's a flat grind. Same on all of these. There's no actual finger toil, but I kind of like the angle that they did so it's easy for sharpening. So it's actually like a triangular yeah. cut in there. That's a little different. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It just gives a little bit different style to it. You can just see that detent track in there. It is a frame lock, okay. Yeah. With the insert working behind the scenes. Listen for it again. Awesome. All of their knives are on bearings, the best tags. So yeah. yeah. We already knew it was gonna be smooth. Beautiful stuff. What do you think, Frankie? Worth $199? I think it is. Absolutely. All right. So let's talk about this tab specifically. Okay. The haters are gonna hate, all right, with the front flippers. There you go. Yeah. This is one, I, I will say this about this knife, okay? Certain knives, um, let's see, that, that real steel metamorph. Okay. All right, price wise, it's not as big of a deal, but to hand this to somebody, they're gonna drop it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna drop it, okay? This knife, you're less likely to drop. Take it's a look got on some that more tab. more substance to it. But the, they're not going to be able to figure out how to open it. The tab there? No, you'd have to show them. But you could actually, you know, hand this to somebody and have them operate it uh, a little bit more confidently yeah. than something like this or definitely not the Wait. Feist. Yeah. Yeah. That was the noise that it makes. That was the noise? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. When you drop it. Oh, it's just so beautiful. You just want to sit and fidget with this knife. It has a fun ability, fun factor. Yeah. More substantial tab, though. That's where I was going with this. Yes. But being that it's just all kind of, I mean, it's not a pocket pecker, as no. Nick Shabazz says. Okay. I it's mean, just kind yeah, of built it's... into the um, the length of the knife there. Mm -hmm. Which actually makes it kind of nice because it makes it the same length. It, it really does. It just kind of squares off the design. Yeah. I don't know. It's It's fine. It's great. I like it. Yeah, I was gonna say, is it right or left hand? No, just right hand only. No, okay. It's actually, what's the weight on it? Oh, let's check it out. We're at the park, of course, so we do have our scale. Yeah, of course, of course. Let's see what we got here. 4.08. Just over four ounces. I mean, okay. it is a pretty good size knife, It's really. a decent size knife, yeah. It's a little, um, you know, slightly, uh, a little above average there. Okay, let's check and see. Wait. Oh. He's above one. average there, too. Barely. Yeah. Nice, buddy. Pretty much uh, pretty much typical on the, yeah. on the handle thickness there. 0.14. Blade stock, 0.14. Okay, okay. It is um, skeletonized in there. Let's show that. So they did get it a little bit lighter than it was. Let's see if we can uh, get that. Oh, yeah. You can see the milling. Mm-hmm. Yeah, good stuff. Love the accent colors on this. It's a good looking knife. It is. I really, I really like the bronze. Um, even the titanium, where normally we would, uh, so the titanium or just the basic silver color, yeah. um, throwing that little bit of extra color on there makes all the difference in mm -hmm. the world. Well, yeah. and then with the carbon fiber, it just looks good. The Shinkansen. I like it a lot. The shin Shinkansen. 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 Yeah. yeah. It Japanese is cool. word. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. What do you think, Frankie? It has this a, cool design. It style. does. Yeah, the drop point blade on there. Yeah. Well, I, I really, like this little groove right here, too. I'm really noticing now that we kind of pointed it out, that triangular yeah. choil there. So it basically, the grind, you know, it evenly just kind of falls off the cliff, as I like to say. Um, but yeah, it's just a different way to do instead of a, you know, just a little circular cut inside there. It's, it's uh, triangular. Yeah. yeah. Now it's see. angled a little bit more. I'm trying to see what others. Let's just show it compared. I mean, it's just a little round one. Yeah. Um, grab one of those um, blues blade smokes. So there we go. Let's yeah, it's just rounded it. too. Let's just show it there. Blues blade smoke, kind of more of a maybe a steak knife style of knife. Yeah. There you can see it's definitely taller in this dimension. The Shinkansen, the best tech is. It is a really good looking knife. Good I really knife. like it. Gives you a little bit more something to hold on to mm -hmm. on this knife. 
uh, for flipping and that kind of thing. Not to mention use and holding it. It's very good in hand. I mean, so is the smoke, but it's just a little. It's a little less substantial for for flipping. So yeah, yeah. Uh, Two twenty five when you could get these. Um, One ninety nine. Relatively new release, I believe. Yeah. Yeah. One ninety nine. Yeah, let us know. We'll put links into uh, Blade HQ where you can get them for sure. Oh, but, uh, and they should have my bird drawings again. Oh, yeah. Definitely ask for one of Frankie's drawings. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Oh, come on, Frankie. There you go. You're you going to edit that, right? Yeah, I'll edit it. I'll make you look good. Yeah. I was just watching that little squirrel walk out. Well. Oh, no, it's a hum. No. What are we Look, it's at? woodpeckers. Oh, I'm going to close with this. Oh, woodpeckers. There they are. They're cute. Okay. All right, thanks a lot for joining us, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Yeah, hit the subscribe button and hit that little uh, notification bell. Yes. Yeah. All right, so you know when all the new videos are coming out. All right, thanks a lot for joining us. Bye.